Hi guys, today we're doing a tour of Crocodiles of the World. I've been here before on a school trip, but this time we're here as a family and we won't be having lunch here. Out of topic, there's also meerkats and turtles, so we'll be showing you. Crocodile! Mind it doesn't bite you. Okay, that's time to bite me! This crocodile looks like it's been made up of spare parts of cars and screws and pipes. Sarah, do you want to see the big turtle? Oh yeah. Come, I'll show you. Oh my god. Look at that, our new gators are um, moving. Yeah. These are dwarf caimans. Um, they size. grow up to 1.6 meters um, in male and 1.2 meters uh, if they're female. But they're the smallest crocodile. I can't I can't even believe they're real. And it looks like it's dead, but it's actually alive. So do you think all those are alive? Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> Crocodiles have remarkable vision. Their eyeballs can go inside their sockets, so it can be protected if there's an attack. Um, and their eyes are quite high up, as, and they have eyes like binoculars. And they have a layer, called tapetum, uh, so they can see underwater, both in daylight and darkness. These are uh, northern lizard caimans, and their favorite preys are snails. Their jaws are very, very, very strong. Um, crocodiles have the strongest jaws in the whole animal kingdom, or probably in the whole world. This is a water monitor. It looks like a bag, but it's not a bag. It's like made out from a bag. Hey, its bag. skin's coming off. Oh yeah. Oh. Look at its eyeball a bit. Its nostrils are on top of its head. Oh, look at that. This is the West African Dwarf Crocodile. It can only reach, uh, grow up to 1.9 meters, but the saltwater crocodile can reach up to six meters. That's a big difference. O-M-E. Oh my God, they're really cool by them. These are alligators, and they're giant. And I think the smaller one's the baby, and the bigger one's the mum. These are lace monitors. They're part of the monitor lizard family and they can grow up to more than two meters. They're a bit like the water monitor, but like bigger. Well, it looks like that. These things, that just moves. That just moves. These crocodiles are so lace. They won't even move. Doesn't even seem like they even catch their prey. These are broad-snouted caiman. Um, they can reach up to a length of three meters, but females are usually smaller. I think their name's uh, broad-snouted caiman because they have a um, wide snout, maybe. This is the most biggest snake I've ever seen, but I was the one who spotted it. This is a reticulated python. They can grow up to 8.5 meters. That's so big. There's two in here. Pythons can eat pigs, dogs, goats, and large deers. That's just creepy. This is a spectacled caiman. And look, we're lucky because it's moving. Wait, where did it go? I need it's it. This is the most active one we've seen yet. Hello. I know that it's alive because the nostrils are moving, so that means it's alive. All crocodiles have four chambered hearts, a very similar to birds and mammals. Underwater, their heartbeat can drop to um, five beats per minute. And mine, my heart rate is normally 76, 77 beats per minute. That's very amazing. This is the green tree monitor. 
and again, um, the prey of them are forktail rainbow fish. We're here to the meerkats now. That one's digging everywhere. Maybe for food, like snails or something? Oh. And that one's acting like it's the queen of everything. Or maybe it's the alert person, where they alarm everyone if there's something dangerous coming. Well, it looks like a bit Their noise is them. very loud. I'm gonna bring these meerkats like every meerkat. jackass they're cousins to kingfishers and they make a very loud noise and they're also carnivorous which means they eat animals in the morning they make a laughing chorus uh, and wake up the sky people according to a original belief they wake the sky people up uh, so they can light the fire and make the earth, earth warm these are tamarins um, and they never have a bad hair day. Um, they're so cute, they're like small monkeys. And that one just tried jumping to us, and my mum got so scared. These are like random, random <laughs> These tamarin have very developed vocal cords, and they can make about 38 noise types. Different. This guy's eating some green things from this tree. It's so cute. Oh, and this one. These are the Galapaco uh, tortoises and they're the largest tortoises in the whole world. But they don't seem that big. Uh, they weigh more than 400 kg. These Galapaco tortoises are called that <laughs> These Galapago tortoises are called that because they were discovered on Galapago Island and uh, it's also where Charles Darwin wrote his book about uh, the theory of uh, original species. I just found an earthworm. It looks like a night crawler. Night crawler. If it be, was chalk, then it could still move. Do they even have any eyes? <laughs> Probably. Crocodiles are very good parents. When their babies are hatching, gently with their jaws, they squeeze it so they can easily come out. Also, with their jaws, gently, they um, take them to the water. And good parenting is quite unusual in the reptile family. So that was it for today. It was a lovely place where we learned a lot about crocodiles. Um, my favorite um, animal was probably the python. So yeah, what was yours? Um, the orangutan. The tamarind. Um, yes. Yeah. And we and got from some the gift toys. shop. We got some toys, um, some stress balls, and look, the crocodile's pooping in your Ooh. face. Ooh. Um, but we'll see you next time. Goodbye.